guys, we're gonna do a, a zero degree cold start. Sorry, I didn't get a video of um, the first start after putting the turbo on, but instead we'll do a zero degrees start. It's been plugged in all night. And uh, today we're gonna start it up and drive it over to a buddy's house. We can get that three inch down pipe welded on. And so I wanted to get some sound clips with the before and after going from two and a half, the stock one, to the three inch modified uh, custom made uh, down pipe. Let's do a couple quick first and second gear runs here. It's pretty icy out, so I can't really do any open throttle pulls, but that's what it sounds like inside the cab with the new turbo. Second gear. Some tire hop there in the ice. You hear that whistle when I rev it neutral. I'm liking it pretty good so far. Alright, the truck's been warmed up and I'm driving over to my buddy's house. It's zero degrees outside. It's pretty icy and snowy. This is the biggest snowstorm we've had up here in northern Colorado so far this year. Sorry, can't get any good, good long hard pulls but I'll show you what it's like to shift through the through the gears with this new turbo and right now I just have a two and a half inch down pipe it's it's the stock one but it's been modified I took out the squash piece so I have that down pipe into a three inch straight exhaust and a four inch outlet I'm only two wheel drive right now this thing's super torquey pretty icy out so it's easy to fishtail that rear end because it's so light. But I've got some all-terrain tires on that help quite a bit. Woo! I'm sliding all over the place. I let this truck by. And then... I got up to six pounds of boost there. Might have to tighten that wastegate actuator a little bit more. Time to do some slides, right? Might as well because it's snow everywhere. Let this car pass. Oh yeah, you can hear that now. Fish town, that's pretty fun. I'm gonna do a California stop here. Do you want to get burnt out? That was all in second gear and it was pretty good. Alrighty, we're just pulling up to our buddy's house now. This is the power stroke down pipe. We're gonna cut it right there. You just cut right there where it looks like it's three inches. Look at the size difference of the outlets here. <laughs> That's a big difference. Here's the three inch V band put on, welded up. Got the three inch band welded onto this side. Got the three inch band back there as well. We also had to put a couple um, dents in the exhaust so it clears the, the firewall and the transmission. If you do it in that spot and that spot, it'll clear pretty good. We also had to jack up the 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 body up a little bit. We had to loosen the, the passenger side bolts up a little bit to put a jack underneath there to kind of help us fit this thing in a little bit better. Got the, the three inch down pipe on. Let my buddy drive.
it's getting a little squirrely. Damn, that whistle. You can hear a lot more out there than yeah. you can in here. <laughs> it's way louder outside the truck. Yeah. to turn the fuel screw down. 